A convenient synthesis of some novel beta kabel derivatives. Assalamualaikum and good day everyone. My name is Nur Aina Bila binti Ashari from University Technology Mara, UITM Malaysia. Today, I would like to share my research project which is supervised by Dr. Nur Hidayah binti Puma. Introducing my team members. Beta-cabalin belongs to the family of indole alkaloids. It is derived from Peganum harmala, a plant which is known to evoke hallucinations. It has a core indole structure fused to a pyridine ring. There are many derivatives of beta-cabalin with diverse promising bioactivities. Among them are triptelin, which can treat mental or mood problems as well as relieve anxiety and tension, pinolin, a potential free radical scavenger, therefore possess antioxidant properties. Harmine, it can treat nervous system disorders such as Parkinson's disease. And also harmine, which can exhibit strong antimicrobial activity, also having low cytotoxicity. Dibucabalin A is one of the beta cabalin derivative. There are only two reported reports on the isolation of dibucabalin A. The first compound was discovered by Wong et al. in 2011, isolated from the root of Neolexi dibuensis. This compound exhibited anti-inflammatory activity when tested in Inus SA with IC50 values of 18.41 micromolar. The second one is isolated by Johnny et al. in 2018 from the stem of Neolexi kediahensis. It is isolated only in a trace amount. The first dibucabalin A compound was isolated in Gawu, Taiwan, while the second one was from Kedah, Malaysia. The problem arises when literature survey reveals that there are no report on the synthesis of dibucabalin A, in addition to limited works reported on its isolated compound. Therefore, it is predicted that a novel approach for the chemical synthesis of dibucabalin A and its derivative will be developed towards the end of this study. Bioactive anti-inflammatory and cytotoxicity assay will also be performed to evaluate the potential pharmacological properties. This research is aligned with the Sustainable Development Goals SDG number 3, which is to ensure healthy lives and promote well-being for all at all ages. This research may be helpful to prevent the current outbreak around the world, which is the COVID-19 pandemic, because some beta covenant derivatives, such as Harmine, demonstrate antiviral properties. This can promote the growth of new chemical industries for pharmaceutical and medicine manufacturing. The first objective is to synthesize the key intermediate of dibucabalin A via pictet Spangler condensation reaction using tryptamine with different substituted aldehyde. And the second objective is to synthesize the derivative of dibucabalin A using different substituted indoles and aldehyde glyoxyl. The synthetic route to dibucabalin A can be divided into two parts. Part A consists of two steps which involve the synthesis of key intermediate via pictet Spangler condensation reaction, followed by the synthesis of beta cabalin skeleton via oxidative dehydrogenation reaction. Whereas part B, it involves further reactions to synthesize the dibucabalin A. In this video, we will focus only on part A. Step 1. Synthesis of beta cabalin skeleton via pictet Spangler condensation. It involves the reaction of tryptamine as the starting material with different substituted alkyl and aryl aldehyde. Trifluoroacetic acid is used as the base in dichloromethane. The table shows series of aldehyde used in the reaction and their respective yields. The reaction mechanism occurs by initial formation of an aluminium ion followed by electrophilic addition to give the spiral cycle. After migration of the best migrating group, deprotonation gives the product. Step 2. Removal of hydrogen on ring B via oxidative dehydrogenation reaction. Iodine molecule is used as the catalyst, the MSO as oxidant, 
and hydrogen peroxide to regenerate the catalyst. The table shows series of aldehyde used with moderate to good yields. This reaction is mediated by the MSO as the oxidant to facilitate dehydrogenation by elimination. The dehydrogenation leads to complete aromatization of the moiety. In total, five novel intermediates and derivatives of petacabaline were successfully synthesized. That's all from me. Thank you for watching.